Recording multiple tracks at once is a fairly straightforward process involving two or more available hardware inputs. These inputs can all come from the same hardware unit, such as a USB audio interface or FireWire interface. Or you can use multiple inputs from different hardware sources, such as the microphone input on your computer's sound card alongside a USB microphone or other device, or even a combination of USB, FireWire, and sound card input. Let's start with a single device. I have an M-Audio Delta 1010LT PCI card installed on this computer, which gives me eight analog inputs. So let's go to Mixcraft Preferences, under Sound Device, and we'll switch to the M-Audio driver. This is an ASIO driver, so we'll choose the M-Audio Delta ASIO, and that gives us our inputs for the Delta card and our outputs for the Delta card. The M-Audio ASIO driver installs with the installation of the card itself. Now if I click the drop down arrow next to the arm button on any audio track, I'll see all eight inputs from the M-Audio card. Here we have analog 1 and analog 2. Left channel is 1, right channel is 2. Analog 3, analog 4, the left channel is 3, the right channel is 4 and so on. So with track number one I'll arm it with input number one. Track number two I will arm with input number two by choosing the right channel. Track three will be the left channel. Track four and so on. And now I'm able to record all of those simultaneously. Let's say I'm recording a drum set and I need more than the eight inputs that are available when using the M-Audio driver. I'm going to click the Preferences button, and under the Sound Device, since I also have some Presonus FirePods installed, I'm going to switch to that ASIO driver, which also installs when I installed the hardware itself. The Presonus FP10 also provides me with eight inputs, but I have two of them installed. So when I click the down arrow, you can see that I now have 16 inputs. Input 1 and input 2, input 3, input 4, and this is the first hardware unit, and this is the second hardware unit. So we'll arm a couple from the first unit, and then I'll arm a couple from the second unit. In all, I could arm 16 tracks. My final example would apply to those who might have a USB microphone or other single source hardware but need to record more than one channel at once. Using the Windows Wave or Wave RT driver, you can use any audio input currently installed on your computer. Let's click Preferences, go to Sound Device, switch to Wave RT, and hit OK. And notice that when I click the drop down arrow, I now have everything that's installed on my computer. There's my M Audio card. There's my uh, first Personas FirePod. There's my second Personas FirePod. Here's the USB microphone I'm speaking to you through right now. And I could potentially record on every single one of these. As you can see, the USB microphone is now showing up in Mixcraft. So with my setup, I could actually record 25 tracks at once. 8 from the M-Audio card, 16 from the Personas FirePods, and 1 from the USB microphone. Have fun recording multiple tracks at one time, and thanks for watching.